Hi everybody, welcome to my channel. My name is LJ and in today's video I am going to be doing a period product review yet again. Last month I did the reusable period cup and we all saw how I got on with that. If not, I'll link it up above and down below so you can check it out after you've uh, finished watching this video. This month I got the opportunity to try out some period proof underwear. If you are unaware what period proof underwear are, it's basically underwear that hold your period. I am on a zero waste journey and that's why I've been experimenting with different sanitary products and period products just to see how I can reduce my waste. And this month was my very first ever zero waste period. This month I didn't use the cup at all. I just used period underwear and period products. I didn't use any tampons, pads, panty liners, anything like that. I literally created zero waste, which is absolutely amazing. I'm delighted with myself and I feel like I have some kind of a system now. Let me get on to the period proof underwear and tell you a little bit about them. Basically, you wear underwear that can hold your period blood up to two tampons worth instead of anything else. So it captures it all in the underwear. I know what you're thinking and my thoughts when I first discovered period proof underwear were gross. I was totally grossed out by it but still open to it and this was a few years ago as well when I first heard about them and I don't know why we don't know about them any sooner but they are such an amazing product. The brand that I have the opportunity to review are called Lilova and I reached out to them and I asked them very politely if they would be able to provide me with some samples so I could create a YouTube video and document my whole entire experience. So Lilova kindly sent me out two period proof underwears to try out. These are the first brand period proof underwear that I have the opportunity to try. How Lilova work are there are four different layers inside the underwear. They have a layer for like absorbing the period blood and then a layer for like absorbing odors and then a layer to keep it all together. It's all very scientific and I'll leave the link in the description box below if you're into that. This is one pair that I received and you can see that the underwear on the inside, like they look like normal underwear. They don't look like nappies. Like so many people were asking me how did I feel and were they bulky? Did you notice them? And no, like, I'll give you my like final thoughts at the very end of the video. And right now I just want to show you what they look like. So I'm trailing, I'm going off on my word of rambling. So with these ones, the four layer padded underwear go right up to the very back and they start almost at the front. Can you see that there? These ones have a very comfortable lace trimming. These are the bikini and this is size medium. And this will hold up to one and a half tampons worth. So that's one size. I actually tried them on as well for the camera so you can see them and I hope you guys can um, see how they fit. This is the second pair that I got. These are the ones I originally wanted. I'm a tongue girl. So I love to wear a thong all the time. So there's a period proof thong. So these are the thongs and they're very comfortable. So as you can see, they're just like normal underwear, except they have like this extremely cool technology in them. I only had two pairs and of course my period lasts a little bit longer than that. So I whipped out my Popolini reusable pads these are organic cotton and they have like two little pads on the inside and this clicks underneath. So this is quite thick and bulky in comparison to the underwear. So you can see in comparison, so that's the crotch area of the Popolini pad and that is the crotch area of the period proof underwear. Can you guess which one worked better? I'll tell you at the end. So I did some documentary style little videos of my few days on my period. So I'm going to put those in here now. Not as dramatic as my period cup video, but it will give you a little insight as to my thoughts throughout the whole experiment trying out these for the first time. And I'll come to the end of the video again to tell you how I got on. Hi everyone, it is Thursday today. I'm just out of my morning shower. 
and I am feeling like my period is on the way. So today's Thursday and last month I got it on Thursday. But this month I'm going to be trying out period proof underwear from Lilova. Last month I tried out the menstrual cup, the period cup, the reusable period cup and it went fine at the end of my period. I was getting there so I'm gonna also be using my period cup again this month. I just want to try out the underwear and see how you get on with that. So today I am going to wear the thong piece and this one holds up to half a tampon. I'm going to wear it today because I'm expecting a period. <laughs> I'm expecting my period to come so I don't want to get any surprises on my normal underwear. I don't want to have to use a sanitary pad because that's the whole reason why I'm going um, sanitary waste free as much as I can. Last month I did use a pad and no I think it was just a tampon maybe and um, just for my transition going into the cup. So I'm going to try wearing the thong and see how I get on. I just remembered that I wanted to try them on for you just so that you can see. I ordered the mediums, so I am going to show you what they look like and then I'll show you what they look like on. So my face is usually very, my eyes feel puffy. So I kind of know that the pressure is on my body. So I am gonna go and try and spruce myself up because I need to go grocery store shopping today. Okay guys, I hope you're ready to see me in my underwear because I'm gonna show you now. This is something I've never done, but I feel like I should do it. I haven't seen anyone else trying them on. So I am like an everyday thong girl. I don't like a full brief usually. But on period days, I would have opted for the full brief. But on every other day, I'm a thong girl. So that's why I wanted to get one thong and one brief. And um, yeah, I'm going to show you now. Be prepared. They feel like regular normal underwear. And they're so comfortable. And they're great for today because I'm expecting to come on my period. And I don't want to have to wear any sanitary waste. These ones hold up to... Uh, half a tampon and um, it should be perfect for today when I'm expecting my period to come. Okay, I still have my pyjama top on but I'm naked down below. So this is the thong and this is the medium and it fits really well. I am usually a size UK, a big size UK 10. These are a very comfortable fit. So they feel like Thicker, just thicker regular underwears. And um, they look great. So that's what they look like. I'm also quickly going to try on the brief for you now so that you can get a good idea what they look like. And that way I won't have to be um, showing you guys my underwear when I'm on my period. I don't know if that's a weird thing or not, but I'll just try them on now so you can see them. So these are these are more of a full brief but they also come in skinny here which i really like they're so comfortable um these are definitely more flattering on my body now looking at them like this but they have the full brief so you can see it there yeah very comfortable you can see there that they're a bit loose but that's totally fine maybe my arse is just too big for them but they're very comfortable they're really really nice yeah, I'm really surprised. I thought I preferred the tongue, but I think I actually prefer the full brief. Especially for when you're on your period and you just want to wear a big knickers. You want to feel comfortable and you want to be looked after as well by your period panties. Like, these are going to mind me now for the next couple of days. So I'm going to put back on the tongue for today. I'm going to keep these for a heavier day. And um, yeah, let's see how we get on. Hey guys, it is the next day. So I wore the thong overnight and I followed the instructions. I rinsed it with some cold water and I don't think there was anything in there but maybe some like spotting because when I was going to toilet I could see spotting but it was hard to see because of the underwear being black which is great. So today I know for sure because I was in awful bloating, pain and pressure last night. I'm also suffering with allergies that's why I'm so puffy and like my cor the corner of my eyes are so sore. But today I'm going to be wearing the full brief 
and see how I get on. And I feel like I'll definitely have like a bit more today coming. Just sitting down eating some breakfast and a uh, few clients in today. So hopefully should go good. Okay, thoughts. So I really like these. I didn't have to use my cup when I did use this. First of all, they're white and these are black. You see the blood? You don't really see the blood at all. These guys stain so bad if you don't wash them straight away. And they also had an odor from these. So these don't have that technology in the Lulova underwear that absorb the odor. I found that there was a small like odor with these, whereas the Lulova, like I just couldn't believe that there was no odor every time. Like it was amazing. The thumb, definitely a backup. So this is only a half a tampon's worth. And there are four different styles on the Lulova website currently. And you can get up from half a tampon up to two tampons worth. And this thong style is half a tampon's worth. So this would definitely be a backup. I feel like I used it very appropriately when I was ex like expecting my period to come, but it wasn't fully there yet. Then when I was fully on my like full flow period, I was using the bikini briefs that hold one and a half tampons. Well, the technology in the brief part, like the underwear part was amazing. And I feel like it did its job excellently. I feel as though the um, lace on both of the underwears is not great quality. I don't know if you can see, but can you see the little, um, can you see the little rips, the little rips on the lace? That happened when I was rinsing the underwear. So to clean them, after using them, you rinse them in cold water until the water goes clear and then you can wash them. So I rinse them in the cold water for their first like initial washing experience. And I was just like wringing it out. And then I noticed then that the lace was all rippled here on top. So that was a little bit disappointing, but it's not a deal breaker for me. They're still really, really comfortable and I'm really happy with how they worked. The same situation with the lace here on the bikini area. So there's a little, this I noticed before I even washed them. So I'm not sure if my booty is too big for these, but they feel like a tiny little bit big on the booty. Uh, I just feel like the lace isn't the best quality. As I said, there's four different styles on the website and Lilova also do deals. So the more you buy, the more affordable it is. There's free shipping for orders over 50 US dollars and then free shipping for international postage for orders over 75 dollars as well. These underwear are groundbreaking. I feel like they should have been invented so many years ago. Maybe they were and we're just not aware of them. My childhood, my teenage years would have been so much more comfortable if I had these underwear as, as a backup or thinking of women who have just given birth and their flow is extremely heavy or even with people with disabilities like for to get your first period and if you have a disability and you know it's 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 quite traumatizing to see blood or anything like that then these underwears would be absolutely amazing for every woman that has a period every person that has a period these are just absolutely groundbreaking i can't wait to see if i can experiment with different brands these are great as a backup like i use like i only had two pairs of uh, period proof underwear to see how they were they're great for a backup like I'll still use them, but they're just not as nice as the Lilova ones. They absolutely 100% worked for me. I love them. I'll continue to wear them when I have my period. Next month, I'm gonna try them together with the cup and see how we get on. I'm excited and I hope I get more used to using the cup. Let me know if you've ever tried any period proof underwear and how you're getting on with them or if you have a favorite brand that you like to use. I would love to know what you think. Let me know if you're interested in trying them out as well. I have like Lova linked down below. So if you did want to check them out, they're there. I really hope you enjoyed this video and this content that I've been putting up lately. Just more lifestyle content and zero waste kind of focus content and also some feminine hygiene style content. I feel like it's very important to talk about these things and not to hide them away 
and shun them and never speak of them. It's so important to talk about these topics. Just to quickly recap, I'm obsessed. I'm definitely going to be needing more because two pairs are just not enough. I highly recommend giving them a go. Why not? I know a lot of people are concerned about walking around and feeling them, but you don't feel anything. You don't smell anything. Yes, you can feel yourself bleeding. Like that's going to happen. You can feel the little bubbles bubbling away. All you have to do is rinse them out and then throw them in with your regular washing. I'll be curious to see how long they last and how well they hold up for the next few months. Again, you're only going to be using them once a month. They are comfortable enough to wear more often than that if you wanted to. For example, if you had any issues with a leaking bladder or if you are going to be ice cream man, <laughs> sweating excessively or working out or anything like that. So these are definitely worth a try during those times of the week where you're actually not on your period. Perfect timing if you're on your period, ice cream man. If you enjoyed this video, then don't forget to hit that thumbs up button. And if you like what you see, then subscribe. And thank you so, so much for watching. And I'll see you in the next video.